FEMAP version 2022.1 includes several enhancements to its user interface. One of these enhancements is the ability to evaluate groups from within the model info pane. In this example, the elements on the surfaces of the bracket are assigned to the group. If the surfaces are meshed or the mesh is updated, you simply right click the group in the model info pane and select Evaluate from the menu. Once the view is refreshed, the evaluated group is displayed. FEMAP's user experience has additionally been enhanced with the addition of methods to select nodes and elements on points, curves, and surfaces of solids. Methods have been added for selecting nodes on points of solid, on curves of solid, and on surfaces of solid in the Entity Selection dialog box. In addition, methods for selecting elements using all nodes on solid, on points of solid, on curves of solid, and on surfaces of solid have been added in the Entity Selection dialog box. For groups, you can add rules using the new node and element entity selection methods. Another change to FEMAP's user experience is the ability to select online help, local help, or embedded help. To specify your preferred help system, open the Preferences dialog box using the File Preferences command, select the User Interface tab, then select the Help button. In the Help Options dialog box, select the help type and for local help, specify the address of the local help server. The local help server is installed by installing the Siemens help server application. Activate help within a FEMAP session, you still press the F1 function key. With the version 2022.1 release, the Entity Display Toolbar has been enhanced to include toggling of labels. In this example, to toggle on node labels, click the View Entity Labels Toggle on the Entity Display Toolbar, then click the View Nodes Toggle icon. 